Millersburg, Ohio, the audacious abduction of you. Us missionaries and their family members as they left an orphanage outside Port au Prince has brought the political strife sweeping across Haiti back home to this quiet Ohio town. 17 people, 7 women, 5 men, 5 children, all Americans except one Canadian, were seized Saturday in the community of Ganthier East of the capital, the Millersburg-based Christian Aid Ministry said. We are seeking God's direction for a resolution, and authorities are seeking ways. The kidnapping was the work of the 400 Mwazer gang, which controls the area where the attack took place, Haitian Police Inspector France Champagne said. The gang, whose name loosely translates from Creole to 400 unskilled, or 400 inexperienced, was blamed for the April kidnapping of five priests in two nights, they were later released. Months before that attack, Haitian police had issued a wanted poster for Wilson Joseph on charges including murder, attempted murder, kidnapping, auto theft and the hijacking of trucks carrying goods. We commit this situation to God. Holmes County missionaries kidnapped in Haiti it was not clear why. Aid groups in Haiti often rely on guarantees of safe passage from gang leaders who issue public assurances for aid workers. Still, the disintegration of government control in recent months has fueled an alarming increase in kidnapping. Christian aid ministries include Zamas, Mennonite and other conservative and Baptist denominations and has worked in Haiti as part of its global mission to minister to physical and spiritual needs. Workers returned to Haiti last year after staying away for nine months because of safety concerns. Millersburg, 65 miles south of Cleveland, is home to about 3 000 people. Resident James Beachy, 59, said his family and others volunteer at Christian Aid Ministries, sorting clothes or funding donations. They do a great job in Haiti and third world countries to help people, Beachy said. We're just glad to be a part of people who can help. U.S. missionaries, children, abducted in Haiti, police blame notorious gang ministry was established as a charity in 1981 and received federal tax exempt status the following year. A recent financial report claimed annual service to 14 million people in 133 countries in 2020. In recent years, the charity has supported three international programs totaling more than $100 million in annual spending.